Box. Hello. Welcome once again to Late Night Sex Talk with Dr. X. Good evening. Oh, hi. Good evening, little piggy. I'm sorry, but nobody calls me little piggy. Well, except my partner. I'm sorry, doctor. Just false of habit. I want to ask you a question about the practical side of sadomasochism. Ah, sadomasochism. A practice that involves the infliction of pain. But pain can sometimes be the best way to discover new forms of pleasure. I'm sorry, this is a little urgent. Back in ancient Rome, we see evidence of sadomasochistic practices, as well as in ancient Egyptian times. However, it wasn't until the beginning of the- Listen, doctor, this is urgent. You see, I have a customer here who hasn't taken very well to his first S&M session. Oh, no? It's important for first-timers to define their limits in advance. Remember that you both need to agree on a safe word so that your partner knows when to back off. Have you chosen one? Yes, it was. Hey, stop that. You're hurting me. The thing is, my client has got himself stuck in the rack while I was torturing him, and I cannot get him out. Please help me. I have to get to my kid's birthday party. It starts in half an hour. Okay, try not to panic. That's not a model I'm familiar with, but... Have you tried carefully loosening screw 2A? Yes, but it didn't help. I even tried dismantling the little nozzle that squirts the Vaseline. And I guess detaching electrodes didn't do any good either. Have you tried checking that the shackles haven't rusted up? Get me out of here! My wife and my son are waiting for me! Perhaps if you were to saw off one of your client's arms... Oh, hold on for one minute. Maybe if I try this switch. All right, no, stop, stop! Oh, I that was the wrong one. Well, tonight we've witnessed how pain can be a source of great pleasure. Or more pain than you ever dreamt of. <laughs> Enjoy your sex.